Hello there everybody, it's Heroic Legend here, and I am back with more Berserk and the Band of Hawk. Or Batbo. <laughs> we are once again prepping. I'm just curious how much money I have right now. A decent amount. Nothing too fantastical right now, so I think we're just gonna leave it alone. Anyway, let's just try, let's just jump right into the combat, like, like, like Guts does. I just want my horse around and ready. We are now no longer fighting, you know. We are no longer fighting demons, but instead of Kelly Boy, uh, well, actual human people. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, I'll leave you this. Oh, the way that the bodies just fall at my feet. Oh, look at that. A whole group appeared right in front of me. Just look at that number rise. Um, I do not know. Uh, cont continue in. Talk from the previous video in regards to the Berserk movie, and of course, don't mention the. Uh, you don't have to mention the. Uh, you know that thing, 3D thing. I know about it. That me. I really have nothing to say because you know. It, it, look, I, I will say this. I will say this. 3D animation can either enhance your viewing pleasure or entirely destroy it. And I do believe that Berserk never needed. You know, any type of, you know, it never needed 3D to get its story across, okay? It never, it never did. Because, honestly, Guts' story has never, it honestly serves from the, the simpler art style. It does. Because in, in the simple anime art style, it's just better. It's just better. It's just good. It, it gives an emphasis to everything horrible that's happening to this, to this man, to this man's group. I, I mean, like, honestly, take a moment to think about it. Oi. You, you don't get to just run away from me. Excuse you. I don't think you understand the punishment you're trying to run away from me. But, okay, I, how, how do I explain this? Okay, think about it, like, as if it was, a uh... am trying to think of another good, older anime that people might have seen. Oh, Cowboy Bebop. A lot of, I, I, I can't help but feel like things would have been drastically different if you... You know, crisp up everything. Okay, man. I, I actually want to put words in my mouth. Doing everything. Why do they always make me fight Judah? Judah's not a bad guy, guys. Like, leave, leave the circus man alone, okay? Everyone loves. Oh, oh, okay. I know one. I know a good one. I know a very, very good one. Gundam Wing. I actually can talk about this because my brother, the Jamer, actually loves Gundam Wing. He has the box set. I guarantee you, if I asked him to explain, to sit down and talk about Gundam Wing with me, just at, at any point, 
he'd be able to provide at least 30 minutes worth of commentary. Minimum. Minimum. Is that how much is how much he loves Gundam Wing? Gundam Wing and Final Fantasy VII. I can get sit down and get a free lecture if for for James. Well, at least uh, old Final Fantasy VII. I'm not sure about the remakes. Jamer has been on pause because he's dumb. He's not. He just doesn't want to wait for stuff. Can't say I blame him. Jamer's never been one to be left unseen. He doesn't like that. No! Don't make me fight Pippin! All oh, this is just like when I had to fight the good boys of the Golden... Golden Deer? No, not Golden Deer. Blue Lion. Oh, that's an exit only. Okay. Well, since you're all here... Dimitri and... It's like when I had to fight the Doom. It's worse, Max. This is Pippin. Pippin was like... Pippin deserved none of what he went through. But you know what? My man went down like a boss and continued to do things like a boss. I, I do not care. We stand Pippin in this, on this channel and in this house. Pippin, please. I'm trying to... I'm trying to pray you. Stop making that. I'm just Kratos the rest of these guys, because it's sad. Kratos, does that make sense? Everyone's done it surely when they play God of War, right? Just went after that screaming civilian and said, I'm gonna pop you. It's not it's not just me. I don't even sound like some type of sicko guys. I'm gonna just stand right over here, turn around, and... There it is. I just needed that real quick. But yeah. The older art style better serves the Zerk. Granted, I do love how the newer one looks for the 3D animation movies. Right? The 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 parts that they have in normal anime style, non 3D, are beautiful. They're they're good. They're, the lines are good, the, the animation's smooth. It's good. The 3D is dirt. It's ungodly dirt. Now, I don't know who to blame for that. I don't know if you even can blame anyone for that. It, it very much feels like a old man screams at cloud type deal to me. But just, like, you had to have known that wouldn't look good, right? Right? Again, it's not the worst. It's not. It's, I've, I, I've, no, I've seen there's worse out there. Again, ghost stories, I truly a thousand and twelve percent believe, once they figured out what they were working with, set out to make it the worst. But with... But to be funny, to, to, for the ha ha. Yeah, I'm just. It, it, this is very quickly become heroic slot of anime. And you know what? I'm gonna say it. I I guarantee not a lot of people would like. Me. I enjoy it a lot of as people would probably put under air quotes. Problematic anime. Now, what do I mean by that? I enjoy things like Goblin Slayer. But I enjoy Goblin Slayer because I like Goblin Slayer's character. Not necessarily for, you know, Well, I, I do like the story. 
if you want my opinions on the first episode, I I'm gonna just say this, wait till I have a foot to stand on on YouTube. I hate to be like, here's why I enjoy Goblin Slayer, and then someone just picks that up and goes, and here's why this person is horrible forever. Then again, I already said I like Berserk, so I'll probably have some watch list. And I'm very vocal about my, le my love of Berserk. But I'm also a simp for story. Like, if you give me good story, I will probably like it. I, and I, as, you know, with Pokemon, I very much do feel like I'm one of the simple folk who goes, just, I, I like this. I like this because I like this. I can't super explain. Uh, more? Excuse you? I mean, go ahead, fam. I have my numbers. Uh, you know what? It's about time you met Mr. Cannon. I wonder who really goes up to someone for combat and is just holding their weapon up for defense. Where are you going? I don't believe you. I said you could flee. But yeah. Um, you know what? Screw having late Santa. I'm going to just say it. I like Goblin Slayer. I like Rising of the Shield Hero. I read Rising of the Shield Hero before it became an anime. And you know what? It was amazing. It's still amazing. Now Fumi's journey is it's just great. I like One Piece. I have watched One Piece. And yes, I know, I know what everyone says, because I have a friend who says the same nonsense. It's too long. I'm sorry, isn't that... How many posts on Twitter, on Facebook, on any social media do you see with people, like, heartbroken because they finished their series? Didn't we want length? Wasn't length what everyone strived for when it came to their shows? Okay, exceptions maybe being Game of Thrones. Granted, I have never watched. I have just heard of the abysmal uh, final season. Really? I'm helping Basil again? Again? Hasn't this man proven that he's garbage? Oh well. Maybe if I can improve him, he can become an actual... He can become a raccoon instead of, you know, just trash. But, like... My, my biggest thing is that... To me, and, and I might... I, I am a very easily pleased person. And what I perceive to be, you know, fun or cool may not be the same for possibly a majority of people. Or maybe it is. Maybe I am of the majority and I just don't know it. That's entirely a possibility. I, I'd, be, I'd be happy with that. I don't care if that makes me very basic. I'd be happy to know that a lot of other people really do enjoy things that I've, you know, said. And let me stop you before you say anything. No, I do not like redo the heal. Just don't. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm I'm stop you right there. Don't. I'm gonna hit you with the papyrus. Don't. Because I will tell you right now. Eh, eh, okay. I do not judge you if you, uh, I, I I very slightly do judge you if you like it. I'm sorry. It's it's just it, it's literally how, how can we push the limits without how can we just you know li it's literally how far can we test the boundary of what we can get away with? Without having to label this as something else. That's that's all it is. 
it, it's just test the limits the anime. And honestly, I do not believe that's something we should strive for. Yes, testing limits is how we get things like... Again, do I think we could have gotten Goblin Slayer in the happy feel-good time? No. Probably not. Most certainly not. Right? It, 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 if we're talking about the, the Shonen era, Goblin Slayer would not be able to... Would not have been able to appear there. I'm sorry. Same thing with, um... Rising of the Shield Hero. Someone, somewhere, would have thrown the biggest fit. Why are we promoting this? It, it, it's a bad message. My views, my ratings. They would have had doubts that it could stand on its own two feet as a story. I get it. I get it. But what potential stories can we get by promoting something like Reaper the Healer? I guarantee you nothing that will probably be breaking any new ground. And I'll say it. I, I, I you know what? I will say it too. I, I, I've already dug myself in this dig in this deep ditch. Might as well go down properly, right? Iaru's revenge is. So brutal. It's so brutal. But you know what? For a man pushed that far, I personally don't think he's done enough. I know what you're thinking, especially if you watch it. That's a horrible. What do you mean he hasn't done enough? Look. I know. I, I I have seen some things from my time on the internet. I have. I got chills. Actual chills. When I saw a serial killer's letter. I, I don't think we're ever given to the families. Their letters to the families of their victims. It is disgusting. Hi, Charlotte. Great in the battlefields of Derby, too. Perfect! But, honestly, he could have went harder in that. I'm not going to say anything more of his, again, if you want my honest thoughts about Redo. I will. That, that is a video on its own, honestly. It is entirely a video on its own. And I'm not ready to jump down that ditch just yet. I. I. 100%. Well, first off. I hate to do this to myself, but I'd actually probably need to watch more of it to get the full scope of what he does to other people. Not just, you know, the main target of his revenge. But, yeah, I'd have to watch more, and then I'd have to recruit probably my brother and my friend, uh, Killer Sphere. Maybe even Starsky. Before I could be like, yeah, no, I need I need people here to help me. Like tackle this. I I do not think redo is anything that we should aspire to. I do not think that redo is something even worth considering if if, if you're a new anime goer and you're not used to brutality, do not even think about watching redo. Hell, don't even think about watching freaking Goblin Slayer or Berserk. In fact, start with Rising if you would 
ever dream of something like that. Hell, go back and maybe check out Afro Samurai. I, I, I really just can't think of... It, it's so hard for me to think of a good starter to you watching brutal stuff it's in terms of like anime and animation but like I'm trying to think of stuff with good story well good story makes sense isn't just brutal for brutal's sake and you know it's entertaining because I hate to say it but uh okay no I don't hate to say it I hate devil man crybaby openly Akira holds all the L's and why does Akira hold all the L's? Let's ask ourselves this question. Is it because he's ineffective? Is it because the freaking story itself does not follow its own rules? I don't know. I don't know why I hate Akira. I just personally believe this man was not ready for prime time and yet they pushed him. It's like watching WWE and being like, please stop pushing this man. He doesn't know how to wrestle. All he does is take L's. He's not even suitable to be a clown. Clowns get more W's than this man. And if only because there's a subsection of the population that actually has... Uh, I don't want to say it, but I have to. Sexy clowns. And I don't know why. I don't want to know. A part of me feels like I'd become a worse human being if I did know. Ooh, blue filter. Uh, you know what? I can't stop playing. Stop running. Stop running. Okay, there you go. But we've done once I hit layer 20. But just. Oh, look, there's Griffith's time, huh? If you couldn't... Hi, Griffith. But yeah, I do not like Devil Man Cry Baby. I hated every minute of watching it. I wish that they would have either followed their own rules or done more to change things up. But they didn't either of that. So why so why should I bother? Why should I bother? Why should I care? I care because some people look at Devil Man. Look at Devil Man Cry Baby and point it and go, look. That's what's wrong with anime. I'm like, no, that's, that's a very, very small portion. The shonens are good. Oh, there's a few, there's just few good ones. There's one, I, I need to watch it. It's just literally about a man and his daughter just trying to live a happy life. And it's so cute. It's so adorable. She's on her way home from school and these two older girls here. And, and she's playing a little game. And the two older girls help her across the street because she's pretending that the line she's walking is like, this line and this river and the whole ultimate side there these two girls help her like cross the street and it's so cute it's so cute and then there's just like anime that just has a lot of heart to it and a lot of a lot of just great moments you know there's some that are unneedlessly un packed with drama yet hold on yeah what you doing you know, and and please, if you've watched Devil Man, that was your first introduction to anime. I'm sorry. I promise you, most anime tries to follow its own rules. They also like don't do pointless things, except for filler. But we we've, we've all agreed that filler is, you know, filler for a reason. But why? We're helping all oh, because it's Charlotte, Char Charlotte, Charlotte. I have not seen all the demons, so I mean to think I've missed one. Unless the last two are here. Rupi 
finished. Oh, I was not paying attention to the maps. I got really lost in the uh, anecdotes. Oh, whatever, horse. You go be a horse over there then. Tosca thing. Look around on the map for a demon. I see no demon. I was lied to. Probably have to go through this next thing. But that don't matter. Because I'm about to send Griffith home. Ooh, two difficult enemies to face. Oh, trust me, Charlotte, you wouldn't be thinking that if, uh... If you knew what he did. Hello, Mr. Demon. You're a hardy one. Couple. Really should have just been using more of my equipment here, but again, I got very lost in my rant. To be fair, it mentioned cute things. So I don't think anyone has a problem with that. Yeah. Oh, thank you, person on the side who just smacked me. Now I have more power. The power to send this demon flying. And probably the vast majority of you, because I'm going for the big swing. Vast majority was pretty much correct. Hi, Griffith. Yeah, yeah, dodge around. God, it's really a Dark Souls match. Oh my goodness, can I... I just... I, I just need to whack him. I just need to whack him with the big stick. I call it a big... Oh. oh, 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 pardon me. I didn't realize that we were just gonna... Hey, 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 I, you showed me yours, I'll show you mine. Hey, look, now I'm angry, too. Well, I'm gun, so I'm always angry, but... Uh... Good night, Gwyffith. Stay down, please. But yeah. The, uh, this episode has been about... La yeah, yeah, shut up, Griffith. No one cares what you have to say. Okay, a lot of people care what you have to say, but I don't. Okay, but yeah. This has pretty much been the episode where Heroic rants about his taste in anime. Like the nerd he is. Right? But that is all for this episode. We will escape the endless eclipse here. And kind of just be done with it. Anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, you know what to do. I much appreciate it if you do. To the fans, I want to say, laters.